It's your boy Octocruel, and today I'm with my brother, rocking the, uh, what does it say? Make Azeroth great again. Shoutouts to S-Fan for the amazing hats. I bought it a while ago, but anyways, we're watching the Shadowlands Afterlives Arden Wield trailer thingy. So, uh, I'm hoping this one's better than the last one. Last one was kind of boring, so, uh... A little underwhelming. Underwhelming, yeah. So, let's just get right into it. Really pretty, though. Oh, Jesus. Again. Ghost bear. Wow, what an intro. Jeez. Yeah, I think that was like the strongest intro. That was so pretty. Welcome to my grove. I shall protect these souls through their winter. I shall see them reborn in their spring. No matter what trial I face. I swear it, my queen. I swear it. Dog, he's a simp. <laughs> oh, she looks really great, though. Yeah. Rest well. And dream. Oh, that was actually really nice how they did that. Season Wait. after season of this drought. Here. Here. It's so little. I know. What's happening? It's causing the drought. Everything from this grove. Everything. Yo, what? Centaurs? No! Whoa! Okay. This is my grove. You will not destroy them. Oh, this guy's cool as hell. What Aralon, the? We are not your enemy. Anyone who threatens my grove is my enemy. I swore an oath. My queen, I kept faith all this time that you would save us, and now you send scavengers to my grove? Why? Called the Wild Hunt. We have culled your grove so that others might live. Will you sacrifice one soul for the forest entire? Or will you keep your oath? No. 
Your heart is pure. I will honor your choice. One last time, you serve the wilds. You will not be forgotten. Forgive me, friend. I will hunt for you, my queen. For Ardenweald, and for the souls we can yet save. I swear it. I swear it. Wow, okay. Wow. Holy sh- Who would have thought Ardenweald would be the best one so far? All right, it's now time for us to uh, talk about what we watched, and I'm blown away by um, Ardenweald. I thought this one would have been, like, last place. Without a doubt, like, there's no way this is yeah, going to be cool. Yeah, I'm genuinely surprised that I like this the most like, out of them all. I think Bastion and Ardenweald, they're tied. They're equally uh, amazing. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be that guy who says I like Ardenweald better than Bastion. I love Ooh. Arthas. I love the Lich King. I love all that kind of jazz. Ooh. But Ardenweald was just... It was beautiful. It was an amazing story. Not just that, but I don't know what the satyr's name. I, I don't know. I don't know if they ever mentioned the name. Uh, I was uh, just so blown away by the visuals, honestly. Dude, oh, jeez. I was speechless throughout most of it. Mm. I, I just, I was just watching and I was completely, what I liked about it is that I cared about the world. The world yeah. building of mm -hmm. Ardenweald is so beautiful. And like you said, that satyr character He's was such a good character. An amazing think, character. Right? Oh. And I liked him a lot. And I liked Ursok in the beginning. I liked uh, like the quick thing of like Ursoc fighting Melfurion, I believe, or Ursoc's fighting. And then Ursoc gets ripped. Yeah. And then he, he appears in there. It was what I, it's like I told you that the thing about Ardenweald that makes it better than Bastion and the other and uh, Skeleton Bros. <laughs> Maldraxxus. Yeah, dude, I didn't like Maldraxxus. I'm yeah, really just playing that one. I know. But uh, what I liked about Ardenweald is that the world building was probably the best out of them all. Like, I want to know what happens in Ardenweald. Why is it dying out? The, What's happening? I'll be honest with you. The story was very interesting. Very interesting. And I like how the story, other than Malfurion and Ursoc in the beginning, it relied on no old characters. No. It told a story that was unique with different characters that you haven't seen before. I and you felt invested and actually really cared for them. Yes. I like that. I like, like I said, that... Like, the, you thing go, is, you the, go. the best thing about it is that, mm -hmm. like again, the satiric character. I wish I knew his name. If someone like in the comments can just you know, great character, give him a shout out for me because I want to know who the hell he is, or I'll just look it up myself later. But what I liked about him is that I want to know more about him. Like I hope, I hope to God, man, I hope that he's actually someone important in the main storyline. Like he appears a lot while you're questing in Ardenweald, and Agreed. he has a lot of like big agree kind of like screen time and stuff because he was the shining star of that. All right, yes. and I wanted to know more about that character the, I, and what he's about. Though the queen, I love her design. She looks yeah. cool. She, dude, she's massive. She, she looks, looks so badass. Cool. Satyr guys like you're looking like a man. Like, like, I love the comparison. part where like everything just looks nice and everything. And then you see the drought, and I like that the satyr character like he's so dedicated. He literally just fought back instantly. I was like, yeah, what? Dude, I didn't expect him. They step action. on his grove, man. If someone stepped on your grove, you're gonna bro. You, you throw step hands, in right? my grove, man. You'd get clapped. That's it, man. He's, he's going to clap some cheeks right there. Yo, you know what? So, to rate Arden Weald so far, what would you rate it out of 10? <sighs> Don't do that to me. Is that like a 10 out of 10? Would you say this was perfect? Like this was uh, great? I, I would not say that. I would say it's a 9 out of 10 because we haven't seen Rivendreth yet. And I'm still on that Rivendreth hype train. I swear, if I end up liking like um, if I end up liking Ardenweald better than uh, Rivendreth, I'm going to cry. Because I might just go I'm because I might just go with Ardenweald first. And I've been like a diehard Rivendreth. But... The only way Riven Rivendreth wins mm -hmm. is if they have Garrosh. If Garrosh is there, I don't care how crap it is. I don't care how bad it is. My boy Garrosh is back, and so am I. <laughs> all right? True. That's, I that's all I need. We need Garrosh to Dude. make uh, Azeroth great again. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Bring him back, boys. But uh, you know what? All jokes aside, I think this was like the 
this it, was it's, the best. It's, oh, it's probably the best. Arden Wild, Bastion, and Meldraxxus. Who cares? I don't know, man. I still like Bastion more, but I think I'm biased. I don't. I don't. I really I like, like Arthas. Okay, yes, Arthas is cool. Ooh, you no, know. no, no, but you're right. Considering that it didn't rely on old characters at all, and it told an amazing and like very intriguing story, I think that kind of pushes it above. It didn't have to rely on that. old lore. It's not even that. I care about. I cared about Ardenweald, like the world of Ardenweald. I cared about it more than Bastion and uh, Meldraxxus. Okay. I didn't care about the, the other. Like, Bastion seems cool, but the world as a whole, I didn't care about. In Ardenweald, I care about the entire world. I want to know why is it you dying? What? You What's got me. Happening? You know what? I'll. I'll co-sign. Ardenweald, Bastion, Maldraxxus. There you go, man. That's how we do it out here. That's it. That's we convert it. people to the Ardenweald hype. <laughs> Yo, it. fairies! Yo, fairies, where you at? It's a tears. All right, so I guess that's it for this video, guys. Um, before we peace out, what do you want to say? Say something. One-liner. That's it. Uh, Maldraxxus. <laughs> you guys suck. You're going Maldraxxus first. You're an idiot. I'm sorry. Ardenweald hype train right now is on full throttle until Revendreth comes out. But uh, that's it for me. I'm sorry, Maldraxxus nerds. All right, uh, Garish... Garrosh did nothing wrong. That's it, guys. Uh, peace out.